All right, Kay joins us now in the studio with some of the most common questions that we're getting from all of you. And Katie, you've gotten so many calls and so many emails. Absolutely, Karen. Over the last few days, we've received 200 emails from people running into trouble. This issue is people are required to verify their identity with this company to get paid their unemployment. So if they're having trouble verifying, then there's no income. So one of the questions we're seeing is, why is the wait time to see a person or a video referee so long? Well, some people have reported waiting for 10 hours. I'm told the wait is long due to the massive volume of claims IDME is handling right now. IDME is also serving 25 other states, so Colorado is not alone in this. The CEO of IDME tells me the wait time should decrease significantly within the next two weeks as they are hiring more staff and expect the volume to go down. Now, the next question. I was getting my benefits until just fine until IDME got involved. Why did this happen? Well, the Colorado Department of Labor needed to utilize a more sophisticated system System to verify identities because of the massive amount of fraudulent claims it's received. Now, I've told IDME has helped curb the fraud, but some criminals are even trying to wear masks when they go through the IDME system. And that's what brings us to our third question. What do I do? How do I get my benefits? I'm about to lose my house and my car has already been repossessed. Well, first, know that you are not alone successfully. If you have successfully verified your identity, that is, but your account is still locked, click this blue strip at the top of your IDME username homepage that says, I verified via IDME, but my state workforce agency hasn't updated my claim. Now, if you haven't been verified yet, try to go through the verification process again and look for the verify identity on a video call button and click it. Then go through the steps to do a video call. Try to be patient. We know a few people have told me they've been successful after waiting for more than five hours. So try to hang in there. And if you're getting an error code when you try to verify, I'm told the company is working on a solution to automatically email you with help. Now, I'm also going to be putting several mm -hmm. helpful links on our website as well. Thank you so much for all of that, Katie. Appreciate it.